Hello students, welcome to PSSZ Chemistry channel for easy learning. Today we are going to learn about the preparation of alcohols from Grignard reagents. Already in the previous videos, we have studied how to prepare alcohol from alkene as well as from carbonyl compound. So from alkene, alcohols are prepared by the acid catalyzed hydration or by hydroboration oxidation method. And from carbonyl compounds, uh, reduction of carbonyl compounds either by catalytic hydrogenation or by using reducing agent alcohols are prepared. So here we are going to prepare alcohol from Grignard reagent. So what is a Grignard reagent? It is nothing but an organometallic compound. So general formula for this Grignard reagent is R M G X where R is an alkyl or an aryl group. X is halogen. So most of the time we use to take Br as X. So the preparation of Grignard reagent we have already learned in chapter 6. Also I will write one time the preparation. So it is prepared by taking alkyl or an aryl halide with the magnesium. So Rx will react with the magnesium in presence of dry ether forming RMgX. So here the bond between this magnesium and the halogen is always an ionic in nature. Whereas the bond between this alkyl or an aryl part of carbon with the magnesium is covalent in nature but also highly polar. Due to this, <coughs> the electrons that are shared between this carbon and magnesium is attracted mostly towards carbon, thereby carbon will have a partially negative charge and magnesium will have a partially positive charge. So with this, we'll start the preparation of alcohol. So alcohol for the preparation of alcohol, we are going to take a carbonyl compound. Any carbonyl compound, it can be an aldehyde or a ketone. So this part is going to react with this Grignard reagent. Since we know that carbon is partially negatively charged and magnesium is partial positive charge, the negative charged carbon will attack the carbonyl carbon of this compound and therefore the electron pairs that is shared between carbon and oxygen, one of the electron pairs will be shifted to oxygen. Therefore, we will get C and here the R part of the Grignard reagent gets attached and double bond becomes single bond. O becomes negatively charged and this part that is MgX part will get attached to this oxygen. So this we call it as an adduct that is an addition product formed between this carbonyl compound and the Grignard reagent. This adduct on further hydrolysis will give out alcohol. So this one is plus. So the Breaking of bond takes place like this and the hydrogen is added to oxygen and OH to magnesium. Thereby the products are R and OH plus MgOHx. So we get alcohol as the main product. So this is the complete mechanism of reaction of Grignard reagent with a carbonyl compound. So now let us consider how to prepare primary, secondary and tertiary alcohol using this Grignard reagent from a carbonyl compound. So first one will prepare primary alcohol. So for the preparation of primary alcohol from Grignard reagent, we need formaldehyde or methanol formaldehyde or methanol. 
So, formaldehyde on treatment with the Grignard reagent result in the formation of primary alcohol. We will see the reaction. So, here H C double bond O H. So, here R M G X. Similar type of reactions only. So, this R will attack this carbon. This will shift here. So, we will get an addict H C H. Here R part will come. Here O minus and M G X. Here plus. So, this on further hydrolysis, what we get? The bond breaks like this. So, hydrogen OH. So, our final product will be C. So, R C H 2. So, R C H 2 and this one OH. We are getting a primary alcohol plus M G O H X. So, for secondary alcohol, like this primary alcohol is prepared. Now, moving to secondary alcohol. Secondary alcohol is prepared by taking acetaldehyde. So, this is. Acetaldehyde or ethanol. So you have to know both the names. So the mechanism is so C double bond O, one side will have CH3 and the other side will have hydrogen. This is going to react with a Grignard reagent. So what happens here? This R will attack this carbonyl carbon. Electron shifts to oxygen. Thereby resulting in the formation of an adduct. So CH3. So similar uh, mechanism only we are going to write. For all types of. Alcohol. So plus. So this on further. Hydrolysis. So, what happens here? Hydrogen here, OH here. So, it results in here CH3, this C, this one H, and here R and OH. This is a secondary alcohol. So, if here it is a methyl group or an ethyl group, Corresponding alcohol, corresponding secondary alcohol will get plus Mg, OH and X. So, this is the preparation of secondary alcohol. Now, it is going to be tertiary alcohol. Preparation of tertiary alcohol from Grignard reagent. So, for this we are going to take acetone. So, the formula of acetone is CH3 CO CH3. Acetone IUPAC name is propanone. Okay. So, the preparation is C double bond C. Either side will have CH3. It is going to react with RMGX. Here also R can be an ethyl group or a methyl group, anything. So, what happens here? This R will attack this carbonyl carbon. Electrons shift to oxygen leading to the formation of an addict. So, CH3, C, CH3. Here R will get attached. O minus and Mg plus X. An addict is formed. Which on further hydrolysis. So, what happens here? Cleaves here, hydrogen, OH, which results in tertiary alcohol. So, CH3, C, CH3, R, and OH. So, this carbon is attached to three different carbons. So, it is a tertiary alcohol plus 
mg oh and x so likewise we can prepare primary secondary and tertiary alcohol by using grignard reagents so the reaction should be followed by hydrolysis so direct reaction between these two that is with an carbonyl group and grignard reagent result in the formation of an adduct which on further hydrolysis will lead to uh, the corresponding alcohols if we are taking methanol or formaldehyde the product is a primary alcohol if uh, we are taking acetaldehyde or ethanol it is secondary alcohol acetone or propanone it is going to be tertiary alcohol so i hope you all like this video if you like this video please like comment and share subscribe the channel for more videos have a nice day thank you